What's up everybody? Well, I got another Steam Deck gameplay video for you guys today. And today we're gonna redo Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Now, somebody luckily helped me out in the comments and told me if I used the correct Proton, which I did use Proton GE in this video, but mine was like Proton 25 or something like that. Cause back then when I made this, I didn't realize you had to go like not just update the app. I knew you had to update the app in the uh, desktop, you know, little, whatever you want to call it, store, or it's kind of like the Windows store or whatever. Kind of like the big old thing that keeps all the updates. Anyway, so I thought that just updating the uh, Proton GE thing from there would make it update, you know, in the Steam Deck's little thing itself. But no, you have to go and delete the old one and add that one in every time. So now that I did that, I went in and now it at least lets me play single player. Now, you still cannot play multiplayer. And I cheat still does not work. So if you want to use the Steam Deck to go fight real people, which is probably what most people want to do with this game, let's be honest. Me, I'm antisocial, so I almost never do online fighting games or anything else. I'll do shooters with my friends. That's about it. I don't generally do stuff by myself online. But anyway, so I figured we could at least get some gameplay single player because I don't think it's going to be that much different online, you know, at least in the fighting screen. So why don't we go ahead and hook this guy on up to the capture computer, go look at the setting screen, and go and get a little gameplay in, both screen and camera. Well, all right, before we jump into the game here, why don't we just take a quick look at these settings? There's not too many to go through, so it won't take too awful long. Nice to actually be able to try this game out now. Even if you can't play online, but there we go. We have just reached the bottom, so now let's go hop on into the game and get a little screen recorded gameplay. Well, all right, guys, let's get ourselves a little gameplay in here. There's a boot camp, okay. What we got here? Okay, so your story is over here, so you can still do story mode. You can buy items, I think, there. That's just Kami House, which is just awesome. Doesn't seem to be able to do anything there yet. What is this? Ah. Free plays. All right, well, let's go do some local battles. Fuck it. I pretty much think we've explored everywhere we can explore here, so we'll just fight some computers. I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked, because just like, uh, what was that other one I played recently? There's another Dragon Ball Z game I played. Xenoverse. It was Dragon Ball Xenoverse, and I kind of got my ass kicked a bunch in that, but hey, maybe I can do all right here. We'll just go to the World Tournament. Fuck it. No, I am just fighting Krillin, but just because they're Krillin doesn't mean they, uh, they'll lose. If they can block everything I do and just kick my ass, it doesn't matter if I'm cooler. <laughs> That's about what I expect out of Krillin. All right, though, let's see what we got here. Let's see if I can remember how to do anything. Well, I can do that move, apparently. Apparently, I can do that move a lot. That's all I can do, apparently. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I don't care how cheap it is. I'm still fucking Krillin up. That's how you power up. I don't know how to fire beams or anything yet, though. Damn, bro, just put me on the ground. Shit. Here, have a blast. Alright, just. Alright, so I can shoot finger blasts. Alright, and that's a KO. At least I won. I'm surprised I won my first battle, honestly. <laughs> that's an interesting way to do a finishing screen. Or a victory screen, whatever you want to call it. All right, well, let's go back to the character selection now. Try something else. That was way too quick to be enough camera time. All right, who shall we try now? Hmm. Oh, there I go. Versus Frieza. Ah, I should have picked a different arena. Oh, well. So sorry, it's just gonna be the same boring place we were already at. Kind of just want to see how the other, you know, arenas kind of play to see if they're all 60 FPS too. Because for all I know, this one's fine, but some of the other ones might drop like crazy. Who knows? Probably not, but I always liked this one. This game makes me feel like I'm playing the anime game, like as a game. Just the way they did the art style and everything. 
And like I said before, it's awesome that I can actually show you guys how this game plays on this Steam Deck now. Thanks, Jim. Someone letting me know. I don't remember their name, but I'll give them credit. Because I can go look at their comment. Luckily, I left that open just for that exact reason. So I can go right back, see their name, and also so I can go to that video and show up. Show, or what do you call it? Do a link to this video once it actually uploads and whatnot and show that the game does at least run single player. Just can't do multiplayer. Damn. Frieza fucked me up. Well, all right. That's okay. Let's... All right, I was going to say let's do a little bit more before I actually stop the recording. I kind of stopped the recording before thinking, ah, why don't we go a little more? So I restarted the recording, so let's play a little bit more before we move on to camera. All right, now let's remember to go to a different place. Let's see. Rocky Field evening. Now, obviously, in real life, or not real life, but in the real freaking anime, Beerus would just smack this thing around, even though it's non canon. I can't fathom some android thing being as powerful as Beerus, you know? Beerus is just awesome. Definitely up there in my favorite characters. I really like him, Android 17, Piccolo. I actually like Goku. A lot of people don't like Goku because they say he's stupid, but I don't know. I like him. He's fun. And at first, I didn't like Vegeta, but he grew on me because he had like changed probably the most out of any of the characters. He turned out being like a bad a bad guy at first, and then he ended up being like a big hero, you know. Falling in love with Bulma and all that, and having trunks and all that shit. So, he's pretty cool. Definitely has an arrogant attitude, though, but hey. Nobody's perfect. Yeah, well, that's about how I'd expect that to go. Eh, you might have, but it's okay. Who's gonna call Beerus out on going too far, you know? Besides maybe Whis. Whis is the only one that can keep him under control, after all. Alright, speaking of 17, let's be 17 now. Alright, who shall we fight against? Alright, let's go against uh, Kid Boo. That should be fun. Alright, where should we go now? Now let's go... Cavern would probably be easy to run, because it's in... You know, not... Or it's inside. Let's go to the island, which is kind of like Android 17's home base. He kind of chills on an island and helps animals, so why not? <laughs> He's just sleeping. <laughs> All right, well, let's do this. Are you ready? <laughs> he did what I accepted. He powered up in the middle of me attacking. Ooh, he got me a little bit there. Looks like this is not going to be a perfect victory. Ooh, all right. And that's a KO. All right, now. I think we got enough screen recorded gameplay now, so now why don't we go ahead and hop on to some camera gameplay now. Alright, let's get ourselves a little camera gameplay now. So let's go fight a little bit more here in the local battle. That'll all work. Hmm, who shall we be?
Why not? Because I honestly don't even know what any of these fucking breaker things do. Let's have him fight. Let's have him fight Vegeta. F it. Alright, where haven't we been yet? Let's go to the wasteland. Be honest, guys, I still don't know how to play this game, and I was never really that great at fighting games in the first place. I was alright at a few, like, Soul Calibur. I don't even know how to do beam attacks. What button does beam? Ah, he got me there and blew me up. Fuck. I'm gonna lose. He fucked me up real good. Yes, I do. He kicked my ass. I'm gonna try again. Ah, shit. Get down here. There we go. I'm not gonna lie, I honestly thought he was gonna fucking kill me after I got that far. Alright, let's go back to the character section. You know what? Screw it. I'll be Vegeta this time. Well, let's try. Probably get my ass kicked again, but... Hmm, seems like it's still has trouble focusing in between scenes. At least it gets uh, gets the action, that's what really matters. Then again, I'm sure I can just turn that completely off. Man, I wish I knew how to do beam attacks. They're so fun. At least I won, but it feels so empty because I'm basically just button mashing and getting lucky. But still, it runs really fucking good, so. Back to the character selection. That's some stutter in between stuff, but in the main, main parts that count, it seems good.
All right, let's give it a try. That was not a fair battle at all, whatsoever. Alright, we'll go back to the character selection again. Must brace ourselves for the coming battle, apparently. Alright, another win. It's gonna be fun if I knew all the moves and all that shit, but it is what it is. At least I can show you guys how the game plays now. Alright, though. I think that's probably good enough, so why don't we now go wrap this video on up? Well, alright, guys, that is a wrap for Dragon Ball Fighter Z, and played it very well. It had a little stutter in between, like, loading screens and shit, but during the fights, we were getting 60 the whole time, as far as I could tell, but truth be told, I was trying to pay a whole bunch more attention to me not getting my ass kicked, but it seemed very smooth to me, so pretty awesome. Glad that, uh, guy gave me the information, uh, to use the Proton GE. I was using that before, but like I said at the beginning, I was using an old-ass version of it, so once I actually updated it and tried it again, and now that it is a Updated. I tried it again just now, made this video and all, so as you guys can see, you can play. You just can't play online. So you can call, play the story, you can fight computers, do the arcade, but you cannot fight people online right now anyway. And it's because the anti-cheat doesn't work. But other than that, it is very playable. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video, and until the next one, peace out, guys.